Julian Assange has been under house arrest for something like 560 days, which is a hell of a go because he hasn't even been charged with anything. They only want him for questioning. In the UK, pending uh, the outcome of a British Supreme Court decision over the legality of his extradition to Sweden. The court found against his appeal and fearing a rapid removal to Sweden, uh, Julian sought asylum in the Ecuadorian embassy. He's been there about 50 days. I have a special message from his mum. Many thanks to you all for coming here today. Like WikiLeaks, Magnetic Island is small but with a big spirit. Hear, hear. Julian and I both have very fond memories of living here. We are facing our darkest hours. Powers who do not want the people of the world to know the truth of their corruption amassing against Julian and WikiLeaks. WikiLeaks took the mask off power and power is very, very angry. Embarrassing the US is life-threatening and along with the US lapdogs, Sweden and the UK and now the Australian government have fallen into line to shoot the messenger. Most of the mainstream media represent corporate interests smearing Julian and WikiLeaks to silence the truth. On the other hand, ordinary people around the world are rallying in their defence, recognising the importance of whistleblowers and of free and fearless media to hold government and corporations to account to preserve our democracies. I encourage you to search for the truth about Julian and WikiLeaks. With the rapid increase in the surveillance state in Australia and the US militarisation of our country, I encourage you to do as Julian has done, to search for the truth the freedom of your children and your grandchildren depends on it. Uh, I hope you all have a lovely day on beautiful Magnetic Island. And that's, that's from Christine Assange.